robotic surgery takes traditional surgery beyond the limits of the human hand, and there are many benefits for patients. Joining me now is the Chief of Surgery at Chandler Regional Medical Center, Dr. Gordon Botson. It's good to see you. Thank you so much for joining us this Thanks morning. Thanks for having me. Talking about this robotic surgery, I love just where we are right now. How does it work and how does it benefit a patient? Uh, well, we use a, a robotic instrument uh, which allows us to control multiple instruments from a, a remote console and it uses smaller incisions, less trauma to the abdominal wall uh -huh. and allows the patients to have quicker recovery. And you were one of the first 100 surgeons in the country to start using this kind of robotic surgery for gallbladder patients, correct? Correct. Tell us kind of more how this works. Um, we're able to put in three instruments and a camera through a single incision uh, that's usually able to be hidden inside the belly button. Uh -huh. And um, this uh, picture shows us uh, what the instruments look like going through the belly button. And uh, we have a second picture that shows us what all of the instruments look like from the outside going wow. through that one hole. And this is dramatically different than the older way of doing it, the traditional method, right? Yes. Yeah, I mean, it was um, a large incision from what I, I yes. recall. Initially, yes, initially uh, when we did open surgery, um, that was a large incision underneath the ribs. Uh, more recently, we've been doing multi-port gallbladder surgery where people have three or four smaller incisions, and now we're able to bring it down to one incision that's uh, almost oh. completely hidden. Who is a candidate for it then? Um, almost anyone is a candidate for this. Of course, um, people who are more interested in the cosmetic benefits uh, would be interested. A lot of women are opting for this kind of surgery. Um, and it's also a quicker healing time, too, you mentioned, right? Yes. Now, when you're maybe having to have to go through some sort of surgical procedure, I'm assuming this is the type of thing you should look for, is a robotic surgery, correct? Absolutely. Uh, the robotic surgery, again, allows for less trauma to the patient and um, often quicker healing. Uh, so you'd want to look for a surgeon who's trained in these kind of techniques to maximize the experience. Absolutely. What kind of procedures can they use with this robotic surgery? What's the most common? Well, at Chandler Regional, the most common is hysterectomy. Hmm. And this has taken a procedure that's typically been done open through an incision in the abdomen uh, and made it uh, totally minimally invasive for a lot of women. Well, so if somebody is, maybe they know they have a surgery coming up, where can you go to, to find out a doctor that can do this type of surgery no matter what you might be needing? Where, where's the best place to start looking? Uh, they can call the resource link and the phone number will be on the screen there. And, or they can go to our website, which is chandlerregional.org. Thank you so much for joining us. It's amazing where we've come with this type of surgery and how you are trained now with this robotic system. I think it's amazing. Thank you for joining us. Very Thank nice you. to meet you. So if you would like more information about Chandler Regional Medical Center, you can go to chandlerregional.org, or you can always call that number you see right there on your screen.